hello my nuggets i hope you're having a great day today's video is going to be my february 2022 kit lineup video and i actually really messed up my intro so this is actually my outro and i'm just doing a voiceover over it so i just wanted to say i'm including four kits and my monthly so let's go ahead and jump into it i hope you enjoy um so basically i have this kit from caress press and um it's actually a kit for march i think so i got it yeah it says the march self-love kit so i picked this kit up because i really like the pink vibes and i wasn't feeling the other february kit or monthlies that was in shop and i got this in the premium matte paper as well it's really nice and it doesn't have the um month on the actual kit which kind of bothers me but um i don't really think I need it honestly because it's already gonna be in the February tab so it's blank but this is what it looks like and I just thought it'd be cool to include monthlies if I get kits in my lineup and then it's cool because it does have like um, the holidays but since this is March I can't use those holidays for this spread so there's that and then I picked up um, it comes with like this extra deco box, which I really like using those squares in my monthly so far. I wish it came with more of those. And then you have two little deco um, like monthly boxes. And then this is for the sidebar. I picked up the fashion girl with the black hair and she's really cute. So that is going to be my February monthly. And then... If I have any sheets that I want to use throughout the month, I'm kind of just pulling them aside. So I have all of these Valentine's themed sheets um, from Scribble Prints Go, which I already did start using some of them. But I have like these broken heart ones, Cupid, you know, inspired stuff, the cell phones, and I really like the colorway. I have the <laughs> That Bitch Cakes, super cute. <clears throat> this is like kind of a little sampler. And then I also have this sampler from Crafty Planner Co. called the Be Mine Sampler. And I just wanted to keep those out like with all my kits so I can remember to pull them in. And then for my dashboard page of my planner, I'm going to use this die cut sticker pack from the Honey Bee Shops um, January or February. I can't remember. January or February babe box. And... I think they're really cute because obviously it's Valentine's theme, so I'm gonna use this to decorate the front page of my monthly. Okay, so for the first week of February, which is gonna be January 31st through February 6th, I'm gonna use this Heartbreaker kit from Caress Press. I love the colors, like pink and black are my favorite color combo, so when I saw this kit, I just knew I had to have it. And I don't know if those were freebies or I picked these up, but, oh my god, these two colors together, they just really, really get me. I love them so much. And so, here's the format. I get glossy, um, full kit format. Super cute. And then, the foil that I'm going to pair with it, which is really interesting, um, is these tapes from Rose Color Days. And it's just the black star and bats. I thought the black would go really nice because I think it stands out well with the pink. So I did that, and then I'm going to pull in this washi with it as well from Scribble Prince Co. It's really old, but it has silver. And then, oh, also for my glitter headers, I'm going to use this tape from Rose Color Days with the black bows and pink hollow stars, which I thought would be cute to pull in more of the pink into the spread. And then for some overlays, I have these silver quotes from Planet Hannah. And I think they're just like the affirmation or self-love quotes. And yeah, that is going to be my first kit of February. Then for the second week, so February 7th through the 13th, I'm going to be using this sticker book kit from the Honey Bee Shop. And this is the January 22 Cherry Pie kit or sticker book. And I'm absolutely obsessed with it. This is also on her new matte paper. And it comes foiled in a sparkly hollow. You can see it really good on that middle box. Just look at this. It's so beautiful. So I'm just going to do a quick little flip through. <clears throat> I 
I love the um the hollow sparkly hollow foil with it super cute look at that the hobo cage and some deco and then I did already pre-pull my bougie box tapes in a sparkly hollow and I believe these are from caress press I don't know if you can really see the sparkliness of it but they are and then I also put these two washies um, on here because that's what I'm gonna pull in with it for my headers and those are just from Simply Gilded and one of them is gold foiled but it doesn't really bother me so that is that week and then for Valentine's week I'm using this this is actually a glitch kit from Glam Planner and unfortunately I did get it in the mini format which I was using minis at the time that I bought this and I definitely would need an ultimate now but that's okay we're gonna make it work somehow I got the glitter header page I don't know when I picked that up but here's the format just really cute and girly and my favorite part of her kits is the bottom washi and then I have lots of extra things to pull in with this spread so the um, bougie boxes and foil is these rose gold hearts from rose colored days and then for header overlays, I'm going to be using this confetti tape from Sticky, no, from Caress Press, I believe, or Sticky Essentials. I cannot remember. They're so old, but I think this, this bougie goes really cute with this kit. Oh my gosh, I love. And then bottom washi, I have this older, um, what is it called? I have these overlays from Sticker Guru and they're actually in a pink foil, but I think it will go nicely. And then I also have these older pink foiled quilt overlays from Sticker Guru. And then I just put this in with there because I'm gonna use the Valentine Valentine's Day script and this is from OK Plans. <clears throat> and then I just pulled in some like other random things. So I have this Happy Valentine's Day um freebie from spc this was a freebie as well this little rose gold foiled freebie from carly or from plana hannah which is actually carly plans freebie and is this rose gold this is gold okay whoops and then i just pulled in some rose gold slash pinky um scripts and um one icon thing and then I have these date numbers from sticker guru as well in rose gold so that is my valentine's day week kit and everything I'm gonna be pulling in with it and of course I will pulling it, be pulling in leftover extra boxes for this kit because it definitely does not have um enough for how I plan last but definitely not least and actually probably one of the most exciting ones is this kit from scribble prints co called control alt delete this is the kit and i got it in the ultimate format and there was like a little um oopsie box because this cat was floating so she included that i have the 15 millimeter add-on washi and let me just do a flip through of this kit i love these colors so much they're so girly and perfect oh wow I don't remember this format, but that is a lot of little things. Oh, wow. I really don't remember this format. I remember loving this bottom washi, though. It's so cute. And then to pair with this kit, I'm going to be using um, sparkly hollow foil and some other things. So I did pre-pull out my bougie boxes, also from Crest Press, and then... I had these hollow heart overlays for the glitter headers I'm going to use. I don't remember where those are from. Either Caress Press or Sticky Essentials. <clears throat> and then I have just like all this random hollow foiled. This was actually the like purple like Aurora foil from uh, Simply Gilded that I might use the date numbers if they match up. And then I'll just do like a quick little flip of the extra bits I might be using. This is like a gridded, 
like a grid sparkly hollow. I just thought it was really cute. Might pull those in. I love this. I'm definitely going to be pulling in this for the bottom washi overlays. Super cute. Um, Murdoch Talks little sampler in ho sparkly hollow. Some scripts. And then these are just like some little overlays, half cut headers. And then <clears throat> I do have some light blue foiled ones from Scribble Prints Co. So I thought I might be able to pull that in. This is Sparkly Hollow from Caress Press. One bougie box tape, I guess. And then this is some blue foiled things as well. So we'll see what happens. That is gonna be the last kit and I'm super excited. So this is gonna be my kit lineup for February. And I know it's going up really late. I'm really behind in planning, but I still wanted to show you guys like what I'm using for February and hopefully I'll get my March lineup um, up as well soon. But I'm really excited and it's actually really cool because all of these are different shops except for the monthly and one kit, but that's really cool. I love using a variety of different shops and there's different papers in here and it's really fun. I'm excited. I like the colors. I like the variety and... Yeah, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed. Bye.